Wow. I have my chrome open. So, the stream's been a little wonky. I'm not sure what's going on with it. It's like cut out before my games the other day, but then like I restarted and we finished the games, which was good. And we're gonna go again. Because why not, right? We're gonna be hot right now. People be playing it. People be wildin', yo. People be wildin'. Always wanted to do it again. What shall we call this one? Mm -hmm. I hear cats or girlfriend or both. It's always a scary part. You never know what it is. Or burglars. Burgle the jurgle. So I still can't decide if draft is a better value or sealed, right? Um, I know I calculated it earlier or whatever, but uh, on the base you get, oh my God, I did it earlier. No, I just can't forget my numbers, <laughs> of course. So you'll pay 1,800 gems with zero wins on this. And it's also hard to calculate because there's three losses for this and two for draft. So it changes things around. Um, I think it's not good to assume you're going to get zero wins. That's pretty bad. Uh, divided by the packs you get, which are nine. And you're paying 200 gems a pack. Three packs. Which is this the normal rate, I thought. Nine for 1800. Yep, that's normal. So that's basically the same as buying them in the store. So if you're gonna buy them in the store, that's you know, and if you go 0 and through 0 and 2, I guess, in the draft, you get four packs for 1500, right? Which is way worse. So you're gambling more on that, um, which is like three, three, seven, five, but. You get higher in gems way quicker, so it's easier to go, like, feel like it might be easier to go infinite in gems through, um, through drafting. I'm, hard, I'm not trying to calculate this, where it's like, okay, two losses here, or versus three losses there. I mean, you're just going to go that many more times, right? You're going to get that extra one chance to get the wins down. The problem is, you need, like... To go infinite, you need six wins, right? And the other one is three wins. So let's give us. So say you have another half. You have another two. So you have another fifty percent try, right? That's it's one hundred and fifty percent of that. Um, so three wins would be four and a half wins. So that would be right here. For draft and expected like win to lose win to lose ratio. Sixteen hundred three. So you're paying four hundred for nine packs versus zero gems for six packs. Or you're paying six hundred for nine packs. Ugh, I like seal as a format too, but I think this is like a sucker buy. But you want to play against the suckers too, that's the thing. So. I mean, a lot of bad players play sealed. But good players play sealed too, try to get like the meta down. I don't know. You get there faster with wins in draft. But you also can like bottom out faster. 
Need two wins to get Yodra. Just three wins to go infinite, though. So that's like the appeal. Whereas three wins will net you 800 down, but nine packs up. Wow. They really have it, so it's like right down the middle, like very hard to decide with what you want to spend it on. Because you're still getting six packs. You're only getting three more packs for six wins, right? Versus like the three wins in draft. You're getting three packs of free, which is like, you know, quote unquote 600 to 300 value in gems. Bah. See how I feel about clicking on the button over here. Using your gems is serious business. Four packs. You get seven packs for free. You can get three wins. Right? Like it's it's not just me, right? It can't be. Like like it cannot be just me. Like, how do you how how should I spend my gems? I'm sure there's articles and shit that I haven't looked up. I'm feeling the draft. So There's so much worse players in Sealed, and I love Sealed. And I need to get two wins to be able to draft again. Can I do that again? Yeah, I'll have seven plus five, that's 18. Which is nice. Versus if I play Sealed with my 2,000, I'll have 200 left. And I need 15 to play. So I need four wins. Bah. Like right down the middle again. Whatever. Nope. Feeling in the draft. Let's do it. I'm sure you want to purchase this item. Yep. Oh, there's a f shock land. Fire this is flying. Four damage target creature opponent controls and two to their board if you control part greater. Fire blader is sick for future let's walk her. Though I just take the godless shrine. Like it's not bad as a land either. Like it's very strong. as you want. Playing to win, for sure. This pack is kind of meh. Fire Blaris is interesting. I'm gonna take Godless Shrine. We'll just hope it works out. is really bad. I might take the guild gate. We can just like kind of maybe move her into gates. This guy's solid. So is this guy. I don't know. We might be getting fed the Rakdos deck and just like start building that. Just in case that happens, let's do that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Grotesque Demise, I still part three or less. Seems solid. This guy's obviously good too.
is what I was attacking. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I or in no man's land at the moment. I feel like the SWAT is good. I guess it's like it does it kills a lot of things that need to die. <laughs> wow. I wish I took the Rakdos thing first almost at this point. Then our duck would be looking really hot. Not that it looks that bad. But that guy works really well with that guy. Because you just combo forever. Yeah, that's a house. I mean, I think I, I can't not look be like... There's no Demir, right? I can't just like ignore this. Your dear hand, those to play. <laughs> Strong. A lot of mana. Dark Arvita. I mean, I'm pretty sure I just take them on removal. Like, we're neck isn't looking terrible. There's no reason to like. This card's obviously huge. I don't want us to just pass up a deck, too. past as well. This is really good. Really good for spectacle. Really, really good. I think we just need the spectacle deck to come together. I wish we had taken the thingy. There's a spectacle card. Oh, no, 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 no. Try those cards. Punch is good. Gobos. Gift of Strength, Arachnus Lock-In. Kind of like the light up the stage. <laughs> Story Tower Artifact Enchantment, Scrap 1. So 4. Okay. It's really good for a spectacle. And hurt them out. Save for some creature if you do, put 2 on it and on it, and then Scry 2. He is like, he's in the 1-1 one -one counters theme, and what else can you play him in Orzhov? But you're obviously sacrificing your gutter bones or whatever, then scry too. That's really good for our gutter bones. So high five, five, then you get a scry too. That's powerful. It's better than the Ilgon Inheritance. And we have the Steely Guy too. Seven mana for that combo. But that's what we're gonna do. It's gonna be pretty, 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 pretty. Gross. Dempter's transport. Oh, Magic the Gathering. Rakdos Gilgit. I mean. One, two, none, just a one. I think we just take it just in case something happens. 
I have weird feelings about this card. I don't know. Like, obviously it looks terrible, right? I think it's probably for like the five color like afterlife stuff. But then it's like, why do you care? Want to play a whole card if you're getting in anyway? The whole point of like, um, this card. It's like, okay, I need to like, I need to win soon. Like I'm quickly like, just attacking with one ones and like swarming you. That like are dying. Right, the flyers don't die. You're just swarming them every turn. You're gonna win anyway. But this will like, this lets you like, okay, I'm gonna like exasperate my hand, killing you, and you're gonna die, which is kind of what this deck does. It probably won't make the cut. But I think I'm gonna take it just in case. It works with the Gabo thing, but we're not doing that. I'm happy we're gonna play Spectacle though. I kind of want to take the Gruul Locket as well, but there'll be other lockets to take. Defender. Resolve Locket. Good game. We can side with this one. Speaking of which. Card solid for three mana. Most of the activated Gilly cards there are fine. Um, burn bright, for sure. I'm gonna blast you. Okay, goblins. Spell, so then it goes one more to cast. Ability second like activate, one more to activate until the lesser man abilities. 2 1 for after life 1. It's really good. Time taker. Rally in battle. Oh. It's a card that I've seen table a lot. That's just my. This is really powerful. I think you're taking the coercion though. This card's powerful too. Solid red creatures. I think people undervalue drill bit. Menace Death Touch. Engine sorcery spells you control have Death Touch. That's fun. It's 3 2. Menace Death Touch. I mean, that's worth it by itself. It doesn't need anything else. Get to the point, so I got a creature, try one. Instant. Act a tree seven. I'm gonna take this. I like playing with the rares and limited, they're fun. Sheep. Oh my god, this ram is so good. It's not looking great here. Ragdus roused about. Let's take out the bad cards. We have one goblin gathering right now. Works with Burn Bright. Sort by. Like you just really need to know what your creature count is. Seems like a fine creature. Whenever Blood Mist Infiltrator attacks, you make sacrifice another creature. If you do, Blood Mist Infiltrator cannot be blocked this turn. He's a 3 1. That's perfect for active treason. Or smell ward. Only a 3 1 for 3, though. Art's oh, sweet. It's Rakdos through and through. It's a footlight fiend. Rakdos trumpeter. 
I think I'm looking for the example trader. Hound. Ugh. My dap was kind of open. A little bit. It's really good. I don't think I can pass that. I like, I need it and want it. This guy's really good too. But being able to trigger Spectral on command is too powerful to ignore. Not that he kind of, I mean, he does it, but like. This helping we get more spectacle as we go through. I think this card's solid. God help me. Carnival. Carnival deals one damage to target creature planeswalker and one damage to that permanent controller or shower sparks you. Or Carnage, three damage to target opponent, that player discards two cards. It's like just okay. It's fine enough. It's just not like. It's not insane. I'm a fan of Blighting to my, myself, but the Carnival effect is just okay. It's obviously better in you know, a deck like this. Spectacle, return up to two target creature cards from your to your hand. Interesting. I think we want the three two. Draw two for two. We're just sacrificing guys and bringing them back and triggering Spectacle. It's powerful. I think the rest about though. That's all we want. I wish. I wish. The Gilgate too. Spire Mangler, Flash Flying. When Spire Mangler is a battlefield target creature with flying, you control against plus two. So it's turn. Flash Flying two one. Then it's all Gates of Blaze. Oh, I wish. There's another act of treason, or an act of treason that we could have. 6 5 for 5, it's solid. We just have the one sack out there right now. We need the Rakdos guy, ugh. That's the, that's oh he's damn it, son of a, the goblin trying got me in trouble. All right, I promise it's the last time I'm gonna rare draft unless it's like something I just cannot pass up. That's rough. Oh, we have this guy as a sacrifice outlet. It's a recluse. This guy's solid. You don't have to have another flyer for his other build to be good. Yeah, I'm actually I'm gonna take the flyer. It's, it's another way to trigger spectacle on, on command. I think, I think that's fine. And it's flash. Yuck. Action Treason or Rakdos Trumpeter. The Gala Gathering.
feel like the trumpeter is the pick. Filet Fiend is a little underwhelming. We don't have enough spectacle for it to be great, great, and that's what Rectus Trumper does is trigger spectacle. It's like his jump. And being 1 3 is really good. Car is very good. I mean, for sideboard. Wow, Goblin Gathering. Goblin Gathering? Star Trek. Alright, good luck, Pack 3. Come on, let's do it. Oh my god, there's also Cry of the Cranium. Oh, let's just read this card. Scargan Hellkite. 4-4 four, four, for 5. It's a dragon. Riot and Flying. Four, activated ability, red and three. Scargan Hellkite deals two damage, divided as you choose among any one or two targets. Activate this ability only if Scargan Hellkite has a plus one, plus one counter on him. So he's a five, five flyer. It just burns up the board. We need to cut back in the game. Oh my God. Cry of the, Car Cry of the Carnarium. All creatures get minus two, minus two on a turn. Exile creature cards in the graveyard that were put there for Belfield's turn. If creature would die, it's turn exile instead. 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 I'm gonna windmill slam this Scarg and Hellkite. That's sexy. That's going right into my is it deck. Ooh. Rick's Mati Reveler. R rare. Two mana, two, two. Oh, this guy's awesome. When Rick's Mati, Rick's Mati Reveler enters the battlefield, discard a card, then draw a card. God, I wish we had the two mana guy. The two mana uncommon. Oh my god. Then draw a card. If Rick's Mati Reveler's spectral cost was paid, instead discard your hand and then draw three cards. Okay, so he's a two mana. He's a bear that loots, inverse loots or whatever, rummages. But if you spectacle him for four, then you discard your hand and draw three. Which is baller. Eyes everywhere. Wow, that's really strong. Oh, we table that. There's a lot of good. Wow, the someone took the comment out of this pack. I mean, the computer took the comment out of this pack. I should say. Oh my God, we're getting fed. When I still have Rekt here, deals come damage to player. The player discards a card. Three two. Okay, it's just okay. Clamor Shaman, Ingrol, one one Riot for three. Whenever Clamor Shaman attacks, target creature. Pwn controls can't block this turn. It's good for my deck. Mortar, there's a Mortify in this pack. Warsaw. Destroy target creature or enchantment. How's that not a rare? Three minute instant. So I was right, it was Mortify. That's how you blow up. <laughs> it's, in the, it's in the set. Captive audience. Uh, EOT. Mortify your captive audience. Make you cry. God. Can I splash for Mortify? I have I have a godless shrine. Can you put that without picking cards by accident? Three goblin gatherings. Their deck's too good for that right now. I mean, this card, this card's solid. Three mana, two two. That makes your guy not block. Every turn is really effective. It's hard to not want to take mortify. I'm gonna take clamor shaman. I mean, it's a mortify. Like it's just one of those cards you take. Rumble. Let's get rid of Rumble! Actor Treason. I at least only have two sock outlets, and one of them sucks. Wish there was something like more sack outlets. Oh, you mean the guy that I passed on that I didn't take? Oh, Skargan Hellkite. Riot. 
Right. Right. I have a few right guards. I can work with this guy. Oh. I might even take him. Just because he's just... Like, 6-6 six, six is very, pretty big in this format. I'm not sold on the Act of Treasons just yet. This guy's just okay. Yeah, we'll do it. We'll try it. There's an Act of Treason on a stick. I'd much rather, much rather play this than Act of Treason. At least it's a 2-1. It's a kill game. Edict is reasonable. It's probably bad with Afterlife everywhere. Well. Scry two. It's like drawing one card practically. our vampire helps our psych outlets we have. This card's really good. And I want the guild gate too, but I think we're good smell word. Scorch mark. Oh, Raptor Demon. Time for me to play Raptor Demon. He's still just okay. Like he's not, I'm not over the moon on this card, but I mean, especially over a Scorch Mark. Like, Scorch Mark is just good, quick, early removal that you need. Waiting for a server. That's scary. Get ready to rumble. There's our dude again. Our dude, bro. Our bro, dude. Oh, this is pack three. We're in trouble. Oh my god, there's a full mystic in this pack. Holy crime. I kind of just want to uncommon draft it. It's so good. That's how good this card is. This card is so good, I want to cry. It's <laughs> crying how good this card is. You get 3 2. Flash. Count your thing. Barf. Just like, just barf. Hey, you thought you were going to get back in this game, and you're not, and you never will. The game's over. I have a 3 2 for free, and on top of my man, I play Planeswalker, whatever the hell I want. Um. Actor Treason. You still only have the two sack outlets. You have the two active treasons on a stick. That's probably enough threat effects. So take 31 cards. What are we not playing? Not playing Storm Strike. I don't even know what that. Playing the Carnival, playing the Trumpeter, playing that, playing Scorch Marks, playing Soul Ward, playing Jolbit, playing Grotesque, playing Pestilent, probably playing.